a lingerie model, wearing a girdle and strapless bra, smoking in an office. In the background, a woman sits at a desk. These photos were taken by Stanley Kubrick in 1949, when he was just a 20-year-old young photographer for Look magazine. Kubrick went on to become one of the greatest and most influential directors in cinematic history. In 1958, an American photographer named Julian Bryan and a Polish woman named Kazimiera Mika recreated a photo that was originally taken 19 years earlier in Warsaw, Poland, on September 13, 1939. On September 1944, during the liberation of St. Mihiel, France in World War II, a captured German soldier is led through the streets amidst a crowd of onlookers. Such scenes were common during the Allied advance, with varied reactions from the crowd ranging from anger to relief. Sailors from 15 ships blocked in the Suez Canal for eight years due to the Six-Day War organized a small Olympic Games, coinciding with the official Olympics in Mexico circa 1968. In the early 20th century, the Peruvian Amazon's rubber industry subjected indigenous workers to harsh conditions. Irish diplomat and human rights activist Roger Casement's 1913 report and photo expose the Anglo-Peruvian Amazon rubber company's abuses showcasing chained indigenous laborers and their oppressive conditions. A man at the beach was fined for not wearing appropriate clothing in year 1931. Hollywood actors Lex Barker and Gene Carman was photographed in 1956. Winston Churchill standing on a Covenant of the Three tank in May 1942. The Margaritas, a Carlist women's organization, is gearing up for a grand military parade on the prestigious Avenue of Freedom in San Sebastián, Spain, in the year 1936. In 1911, scientists T. Griffith Taylor and Charles S. Wright found themselves in the harsh and icy landscapes of Antarctica as part of the British Antarctic Expedition, led by the renowned explorer Robert Falcon Scott. This expedition holds a significant place in the history of polar exploration and scientific research. The American teenager Dick Clark found himself involved in the testing of dentine gum advertising circa 1956. A group of four women embarked on a skiing adventure in the picturesque Mount Lassen area of California in 1942. The iconic singer Tina Turner was captured hanging out at the Eiffel Tower in Paris for a photo shoot in year 1989. Royal Air Force. Flying Ace Douglas Bader met Major Alexander Hess, the commander of the 310 Czech Fighter Squadron, marking a crucial moment in World War II, showcasing the role of the Royal Air Force and the Allied forces. On February 29, 1924, suffragists gathered outside the House of Commons in London. The suffragists, primarily women, advocated for women's voting rights through peaceful means. This picket was part of the broader UK women's suffrage movement, symbolizing their ongoing commitment to the cause. Full suffrage was achieved in 1928. A rare photo was taken of the notorious criminal duo Bonnie Parker and Clyde Barrow, Bonnie and Clyde were a criminal couple who gained notoriety during the early 1930s for a series of bank robberies, burglaries and murders. Around 1920, we see a Native American girl on the Penobscot Indian Reservation in Maine, 
sharing a moment with her faithful dog. This photograph offers a glimpse into the daily life of the Penobscot tribe during the early 20th century. East Berlin policeman observing a West Berlin photographer in 1961. In 1959, the notable actor Errol Flynn and his companion Beverly Ardland were captured together at the Red Skelton Show. Errol Flynn, known for his dashing roles in swashbuckling adventure films, and Beverly Ardland, his much younger girlfriend, created quite a stir during this period in Hollywood. Two soldiers at the conclusion of the Battle of Stalingrad in February 1943. In this pivotal battle, the Soviets emerged victorious, but at a tremendous cost, with over 700,000 casualties for Germany and a staggering 1.1 million for the Soviet Union. A photograph taken in 1886 shows children in a schoolroom in the Lower East Side of New York. On August 22, 1941, Finnish and German soldiers are seen together on a rail cart in Kistinki, Karelia, a moment during the early stages of World War II, when Finland and Nazi Germany were briefly aligned in their military objectives. Finnish seamen are seen laying contact mines in the Gulf of Finland on May 18, 1942. Ford T. Snow edition in the 1920s. German Field Marshal August von Mackensen, a renowned military leader during World War I, remained loyal to the monarchy until his death in 1945 at the age of 95. An American soldier and a French resistance member inspect the Natzweiler Struthof Crematorium in 1944. A group of Allied soldiers attending a mass and praying in Libya in December 1940. Confederate Army and Union Army veterans shake hands at the 1913 Gettysburg reunion, commemorating the 50th anniversary of the Battle of Gettysburg. A young boy with his homemade wooden bicycle, circa 1912. The American photographer Burton Holmes is captured wearing traditional Korean clothing, known as a hanbok in Seoul, Korea, in year 1899. An exceptionally rare 1970s photo of Kim Jong-il shaking hands with his future wife and singer, Ko Yong Hui, who would later become the mother of Kim Jong Un. We hope you enjoyed this journey into the past. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Until next time, stay safe and curious.